Uh, so hello everyone. Uh, today we are going to speak, uh, maybe discuss a bit about interoperability and decentralization. Uh, now for most of you, I believe that it would be a very, very common topic, like why are we even speaking about this? So, I mean, it's more like that we have come to a fireman's conference and talking about the importance of water, right? But if that was true, then why have been these incidents happening in the recent past? You see, FTX, fall of FTX, I wouldn't you know, really go much into detail, uh, the Terra collapse, uh, the insider trading at Coinbase, and the Ronin hack, which is a cro cross-chain hack. All of these actually point out to one problem, that the solution of interoperability is still not at the base or not at the priority of quite a lot of solutions out there. So this is where we, as Chidex, come into play with our philosophy of giving you the complete decentralized and complete interoperable solution without using any you know, lousy solutions like a bridging. I'm sorry, I do not want to offend anybody who's here for uh, bridging solutions or wrap tokens. So, yeah, in recent times, the problems of this interoperability and decentralization has actually given rise to decentralized exchange. One of the problems with current decentralized exchanges is that, you know, it's not as user-friendly and not as feasible as a, as a normal centralized exchange. That is one of the reasons why most of the people, even though it's not so secure, and even though it's not really, uh, what can I say, it uh, actually defies all the logic and all the philosophies of blockchain, of you know, having a trustless conversation or a trustless protocol, still people choose to trade in centralized exchange. And in 2022 itself, we have seen that quite a lot of, happen quite a lot of things have happened, which has given rise for people to trust on the decentralized exchange like the DEX. So if we are to perform, you know, let's say interoperability, what does this actually mean? You see, blockchain as an infrastructure or blockchain as an internet does not understand anything that comes beyond its infrastructure, okay? Blockchain does not understand anything that comes from the real world or it does not understand anything that comes from the different protocol or a different blockchain itself, which brings us to the point of interoperability and why is it very important? Because if we are unable to connect 100 internets together, then we will have disorganized and you know, not a very viable solution of what we are using to do, uh, what we are doing today. Like for example, in Web2, you don't have hundreds of internets. You go to one internet and you do your job. We need something like this for future. The problem is so severe that even the layer one and layer two cannot talk to each other without the use of a bridging solutions. And this becomes, and the problem with the current DEXs also is like, is contained in all these four, uh, you know, blocks that you have seen. So what does exactly Chidex do? We do nothing of, you know, of high intelligence of, or any complex thing. What we do is we enable protocol to protocol transfer of tokens from two different protocols or two different blockchains without using any not so secure bridging solutions or without using any kind of wrap tokens. So this gives rise to the philosophy of Chidex where we believe that we believe uh, that we bring the true interoperability and true security of the protocols we do not at chidex we do not have an, any anchor uh, any anchor blockchain currently we are live on six different blockchains one of them is a non evm based in future in our next phase we are going to have different wasm based chains on which we are going to be live and this is where we solve the problem of interoperability by letting you understand that the tokens that you choose and the token that you want, they can both be on the protocols and you don't have to rely on any centralized exchange or any costly bridging solutions that can always be hacked. It is always your token, it is always your wallet, and it will always be with you. So this is where I'd like to you know, end my uh, small presentation on interoperability and the decentralization part. This was me, Nitesh, uh, founder of Chidex. Uh, Hope to connect with you guys soon. Thank you.